Yo guys, what is going on? It is Zippy. Welcome to today's video. Now today guys is actually going to be a match review. So obviously on Boxing Day Preston played Leeds and I didn't go because I was with my family instead. Um, so I thought I'd just do a match review. I'm going to do this every time I don't go to a game. Um, but yeah, so... Like, I'm getting even. But yeah, so anyway, let's get right into this. So yesterday... We got beat by Leeds United by four goals to one. Um, apparently, they deserved it as well, and it was a bit of a, it's a bit of a game where we just like couldn't be asked. Um, but there's one big talking point in the game, and that was because uh, there was a red card for Jermaine Beckford, um, and I've. And from what I originally heard, it sounded as if it was completely deserved. So, yeah, it sounded as if it was deserved, and if he'd actually properly kicked out at someone. But then I've gone and looked at the um, at the highlights, and I've seen that what I heard wasn't a hundred percent true. Now, people have said to me that, "Oh, he's been a biased Preston fan." Yeah, fuck off, fuck off. Don't call me biased. I'm not biased. Having looked at the replay, I do not believe he should have been sent off. Obviously, a few weeks ago, he got sent off against Sheffield Wednesday. This is his first game back. And at, at, when he got sent off against Wednesday, he should have got sent off. I'm not going to say he shouldn't have been, because there's no way you can condone that behaviour. But I don't think that that was a red card. And I'll tell you why. And it's because he got fouled and was hurt, you fucking idiots. Honest to God. Just look at the replay and then tell me what you see. And if you say it's a foul, go jump off a cliff, yeah? I'm just going dark as fuck, my god. But anyway, I'm going to get right into the rest of this, and I'm going to talk about the whole thing. So let's get going. So yeah, um, so what happened was the ball got kicked out to him, if you've not seen it, obviously. The ball got kicked out to him, and uh, then someone nutted him in the back. So he went down. And his foot came up as he went down. So, like, if, if I'm here, like, I'm wearing... So his foot came up like this. So he, he went down, he was on his back, and his foot just came kind of came up. And unfortunately, there was a Leeds player in his way. And it hit him on the head. Now, the, and now I'm not going to say that it probably wasn't a free kick. And, a, and probably a booking, because it was. But then again, on the flip side, we could have also had a free kick for a push on him, or whatever, like, nut, when he got nutted. So, and he got sandwiched and all. So, um, so there's that there's that part of it. But there's also the fact that I, it, he couldn't have helped it. The man was there, he'd gone down hurt. Beckford had gone down hurt, and the Leeds man was just there, in, in the wrong place at the wrong time, and the ref sent him off for it. And it's absolutely ridiculous. I, I d me being me, I don't think it was. And having, I originally I thought, for God's sake, someone gave him some discipline, he's kicked out. I look back over the replay, and I thought, hold on a minute, that doesn't look like a red card. And I'm not the only one who's done this. My dad, he, he had a look, he, he told me that Beckford had kicked out at someone and got sent off. And he agreed with me at the first point, saying, oh yeah, he probably should need some sort of disciplinary thing. We've both looked over the replay, and we've both said he probably shouldn't have been sent off. It was a bit harsh because he couldn't have helped it. Because he couldn't have helped it by accidentally kicking someone in the face when he's gone down injured. And I, right, okay, so I was, I was speaking to my friend the other day. Well, no, actually earlier, in fact. And he was saying that, uh, oh, no, yeah, he should have been sent off. Oh, he's kicked him in the face. There's no excuse for it. I'll tell you the fucking excuse, you idiot. He went down injured, and you can't even see that. Oh, but he did it on purpose. You can tell by the way he didn't apologize. Yeah, he didn't fucking apologize. He acted... And, and, he, and you're saying he acted confused when he saw the red card. But you don't act confused when you see a red card, you dipshit. Who does that? What kind of retard acts surprised to see a red card? It doesn't make sense. <laughs> Just get your fucking facts right. Right. Go have a look at it, get your facts right, then come back to me and say it was a foul. Because it wasn't a fucking foul. There's not a cat in hell's chance. And Grayson said that it was. Grayson, fuck off. He was stood right in front of him. You could clearly see that he'd been hurt and that he'd gone down. And his feet just came up. And if, you, and if you're still saying that it's a foul, then you're fucking clueless. 
Are you taking the piss? You're actually having a joke. Don't, it wasn't a red. It wasn't a red. That is the end of the story. Don't try and tell me it wasn't because I'm not being swayed. Look, I, could, I could go on for days about this, but I'm not going to because I've got places to. I've got things to do and places to be. So yeah, but that 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 to me it wasn't a red card. Say what you will, but it was not a red card. I think the ref was a little unfair with that. With that, it wasn't a red. I'm not being swayed there. It wasn't a red. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching today's video. It's going to be the end there. If you have enjoyed, please slap a like. Subscribe as well if you're new around here and you like what you see. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you later. Goodbye.